Hi everyone, my name is Keegan. I'm the Business Development Manager for Sona. On today's Tech Tuesday, I'm going to be walking you through the Point Catalog System. So follow me over to the table. Alrighty guys, here we have the Point Dashboard. Uh, so to edit the catalog, what we're gonna to wanna to do is pop into the Register app. Okay, as you can see, this is loaded up here. We wanna go over to the top menu at the sidebar and click Catalog. Wonderful. Now that's loaded up, you can see we're in Keaton's Kitchen. Really great spot, highly recommend. Um, so from what you're gonna to wanna to do here, to add an item, you can also edit any items that exist. We're gonna pop in here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add a coffee, okay? For our big coffee drinker in the office, Julie. Um, we're gonna pop in and call it coffee, okay? And we're charging $2.99 for small, it's good coffee. Okay, uh, from here, you can actually change the icon. And we're gonna add this coffee icon right down here. You can even edit the color, that looks great. Um, you can edit the modifiers now. Uh, so for example, you can create a new one if you don't already have an existing. So for here, you can do an example for size. Okay, so for the small, it's gonna be 299. So we'll just add on modifiers for a medium and a large. Medium. And so for a medium, we're gonna add on another $1.59. Why not? And for a large, it'll be 299, let's say. Okay. So we're gonna save that. So those modifiers are on there. So when we go to save, perfect. So that's in there now. So now you know how to add an item, how to add a modifier. And if you pop in here, you can also add the colors and an icon. Okay guys, next up, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to actually process this in the register app. Uh, so how you would essentially present it to a customer, okay? So you wanna come back over here and go to the register app. And just by the way, sometimes when you add items, it does take a little bit of time for it to update on the register side. So just be patient. Sometimes it'll prop, prompt you to update it on your own, um, but usually it'll pop up within a couple minutes. So from here, if somebody were to order a coffee, let's say we can pop in and now you have the option for a medium or a large. Okay. So let's say I only need a medium. I've already had a coffee today. We're going to click apply. So there you go, the totals at the bottom, that adds tax as well. So we're gonna to go to order details here and you can see exactly what was ordered. Okay, and then we can go to cash, if you're gonna pay in cash, of course, and then you can add the cash there. Now let's say you're gonna be paying with debit or credit. Go over to debit or credit. And then on this side, you can see that the tip prompt will come up. So you can select a tip. Uh, for the customer on the other side of the machine. So let's say I had quality service today, 10 out of 10, we're gonna get a 20% tip. Amazing. Now from there, the customer simply brings their phone or card up to the screen to click tap. Of course, you can also insert your card right up here. Now let's say that was processed. You can also, of course, do manual entry, uh, depending on uh, your setup, and it will ask you if card is present, and take you through the exact same steps uh, where you'd have to enter the card number. And there you have it, folks. Thank you so much for watching today's demo of the Point Catalog. Uh, very simple, very user-friendly, as you can see. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to info at sonapay.ca. Once again, my name is Keegan, and thank you so much for watching today's Tech Tuesday.